Let me guess, you're looking for a contractor and they're all busy. Stick around, I'm gonna share with you three tips on how to find an awesome contractor. Good afternoon, it's Mark Adams here. Hope you're doing well. So you've got this really cool project you wanna get done around your house and you can't find any contractors because they're all busy. Well, guess what? Everybody's busy right now. I totally understand it. I'm gonna give you three tips on how to find a really awesome contractor. Number one is referrals. Reach out to your sphere of influence, Facebook, Nextdoor, and ask them, do you know a specific contractor that does this work? What you can do is you can ask them, did they show up on time? Did you like their quality of work? Did you like what they charged? Did they do a good job? Those are the kind of questions you can ask the person that referred them to you so that you can get a feel for their work. And then when you speak, to that contractor, you can specifically ask them, are you licensed and insured? Every job is different, so depending on what type of contractor you're looking for, it may be important that they're licensed and insured. The second tip is, is you can call the supply house. Let me give you an example. So when we got ready to renovate our house about eight years ago, the trim carpenter that I normally use wasn't available. So I called the lumber yard, in this case it was Sears Lumber, and I asked the counter sales, I said, who's the best counter sales person you have? and they referred me to a salesman and I asked him who was his number one trim carpenter for doing work and he gave me the name of Rodney Poston, I'll never forget that, and Rodney did an amazing job for us. In fact, we still refer Rodney out to this day. So like if you're looking for an electrician, you can call an electrical supply house like Atlantic Electrical. If you're looking for a plumber, you can call Ferguson, you can call Milne. There's several supply companies, usually per industry, that you can call up and ask them who do they work with that they have a good relationship with that they know will do a good job for you. And it just depends. Sometimes. Bigger companies are better. It just depends on what you're looking for. I like somebody that's been in the business five or six years or longer just because if something does happen with the workmanship, chances are they'll still be in business. I typically like people who are licensed and insured. Smaller companies may not be, but you have to ask those questions depending on what you're looking for. And finally, if you're looking for a great contractor, chances are, I know someone because I keep in contact with them regularly. As you can imagine, people are asking me all the time, who do you know that does this type of work? And chances are, I have somebody that's reputable, that we've worked with in the past, that will do a really good job for you. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions about contractors or there's people that you're looking for, don't hesitate to reach out to me. You can call, text, email me. I'd be happy to share one of our amazing contractors with you. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye-bye.